Yo guys, le rato khanyaho. Yo, I'm just so sad, so so sad for her because she lost another baby. And if you've been following her at all, you will know that you know she came public um a while back about her struggles, you know, um getting pregnant and carrying the baby to term. She's had miscarriage after miscarriage after miscarriage. And it happened again. If you remember on the 14th on Valentine's Day, um, everyone calls that day Lerato Khanyaho Day because the husband always just does the most for his woman. And it's always like, oh my God, you know, most of us find so much inspiration in the way he will spoil her and the things that he will do for her. But this year, my goodness. While she was blowing up on social media and some people actually, you know, making fun and, you know, um, about the situation that she hasn't posted anything this year, she was grieving her baby. Like, literally, just um, had just found out about that loss and... Yo, I'm just so sad. You know, as a woman in the black community, I know what some of the women go through when they can't have a baby or they can't carry a baby to term. The kind of ridicule that they are subjected to, you know, the kind of ama him him or that, you know, the way people will be talking behind their back, making it like it's their fault and all of that. Like, I just wish people didn't do that because... This thing is devastating. You know, in one of the stories that she posted, um, she actually says, after she says, Dear Feb, you've hurt me. She says she was not planning on sharing this news on social media, but it seems like there is someone or some people that were using this against her or wanted to use this against her. Like, guys, Mara, who does that? Can people be kinder? Can people be more you know, just be kind and understand that people are going through a lot. People are going through the most and we really don't lose anything by being kind, you know, and just understanding, Uguti, the world needs a bit more kindness because there's just so many people ready to ridicule someone, to make fun of them, to make them feel pain. And But why? You know, most of us don't even know this woman. I don't know a single thing, bad thing that she's done to anyone or said about anyone. And for people to come for her for something that she herself cannot control or help, like, it's just so, so sad. Like, seriously. She's a human being with feelings, with a heart, you know, and you can tell from the, the, the stories that she posted, the pain, the deep, deep pain that she's dealing with because of this loss and I just wish we were just a little more kinder. So I'm saying prayers up for Lerato. She really deserves to smile and be a mom and just you can tell Guti she's gonna be a really, really great mom one day and that's seriously my wish for her. Can people be a little kinder? Say a little prayer for her.